Hello, boys and girls. Today we'll be talking about multiplication strategies. We're going to go ahead and look at five ways we can multiply. You may use a multiplication chart. You may put the numbers in equal groups. You may make arrays. You may use repeated addition or skip counting. Let's get started. Here is a scenario. Mrs. Muneer counted four octopus in the tank. She knew one octopus has eight legs. How many legs are there in the tank? So we have four octopus in the tank, and then each one has eight legs. Let's go ahead and draw this out. I have my four octopus. Each one has eight legs. You may also write the equation four times eight equals You may also go ahead and put these in groups. We have four circles. We're going to be using tally marks and we'll put eight tallies in each circle. So our answer is there are 32 legs in the tank. This is a multiplication table. A great way to make your table is always have an X in the left hand corner. Go ahead and number your table 1 through 12 going down, 1 through 12 going across, and you may go ahead and fill in all of the multiples. So count by ones. Count by twos, threes, fours, fives, six, sevens, eights, nines, tens, elevens, and twelves. So you're going to go down, and then you can also go across and make sure you have every number filled up. Let's go ahead and look at a short video on how you can use this table to multiply. Let's go ahead and put our finger on 10 and 3. If you go ahead and drag your fingers, your answer is 30. 9 times 4. The answer is 36. 7 times 6. The answer is 42. 8 times 4. The answer is 32. 9 times 3. The answer is 27. 6 times 8. The answer is 48. Let's go ahead and use a different strategy. We're going to go ahead and make equal groups. We have the example 3 times 4. 3 is a factor. 4 is a factor. The first factor lets you know how much circles you need to make. I have 1, 2, Three. The second factor lets you know how much tallies you need in each circle. So the number is four. So I have four, four, four. Can you tell us the answer? Answer 
Let's try another one. Five times seven. We are going to make five circles. One, two, three, four, five. We're going to put seven tallies in each circle. Seven, 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 seven. And our product, which is the answer, is going to be 35. Four times three. How many circles should you make? You should make four circles. Three tallies in each circle, which gives us the answer 12. Now let's go ahead and make a raise. We have in the example four times five. The first factor lets you know how much X's to draw going straight down. There's four, so we're drawing four X's. Make sure you're putting it going down. The second factor lets you know how much X's to draw going across. So you need a total of five. Since you already made the four, you just need to add four more to make it five across. And then you will go ahead and fill in the X's that you may need to close up your array. And this is what it will look like. Four going down, five going across. Four going down, five going across. And you basically add all of the X's up and your product is 20. Let's try another example. Three times six. Three X's going down, six X's going across. Three going down, six across. Three going down, six across. Our answer is going to be 18. Four times seven. Four going down, seven going across, and you will get the answer, 28. Now let's go ahead and try repeated addition strategy. We have the example, eight times four. You can add eight four times. Eight plus eight plus eight plus eight gives us 32. Six times five. You can add six five times. One, two, three, four, five, and you're gonna go ahead and add. Six plus six plus six plus six plus six gives us 30. Skip counting. Two times five. Go ahead and count by twos. You may use your fingers. Two, four, Six, eight, ten. Two times five equals 
ten. Now it's your turn. Use one of the strategies to solve the equation. Eight times five. You may use a multiplication table, equal groups, arrays, repeated addition, or skip counting. If you need to go back to the video and watch it again, please do so. Example number two, nine times eight. Example number three, four times six. Example number four, seven times two. You may go ahead and practice your times table. Zero times table, one times table, two times table, three times table, four times table, five times table, six times table, seven times table, eight times table, nine times table, ten times table, eleven times table, and finally, the twelve times table. We hope you enjoyed our multiplication strategies video. Thank you so much and have a great day.